two young princesses destined to rule. But what makes Princess Leonor of Spain and Princess Elizabeth of Belgium so unique? Let's find out. Welcome to Royal Hidden News, where we bring you the latest insights into the world of royalty. Today, we're comparing two of Europe's most prominent young heirs, Princess Leonor and Princess Elizabeth. Princess Leonor was born on October 31, 2005, as the first daughter of King Felipe VI and Queen Letizia of Spain. As the Princess of Asturias, she is first in line to the Spanish throne, set to become the first Queen Regnant of Spain in over a century. Princess Elizabeth, born just four years before Leonor, on October 25, 2001, is the eldest child of King Philippe and Queen Matilda of Belgium. As the Duchess of Brabant, she will one day become Belgium's first Queen Regnant. Both princesses represent the future of their countries, but their paths are unique. Both royals have a strong academic background. Princess Leonor attended UWC Atlantic College in Wales, a school known for its emphasis on international understanding and leadership. She is currently undergoing military training at Spain's General Military Academy as part of her preparation for her future role as Spain's Queen. Princess Elizabeth also attended UWC Atlantic College, where she completed her international baccalaureate. Afterward, she enrolled at the Royal Military Academy in Belgium, where she spent a year training before going on to study history and politics at the University of Oxford. Both princesses are receiving top-tier education, preparing them for the responsibilities of their thrones. As future queens, they are beginning to take on royal duties. Princess Leonor made her first public speech at just 13 years old during the Princess of Asturias Awards in 2018, displaying incredible poise and maturity. Similarly, Princess Elizabeth has been taking on increasing responsibilities in Belgium. She regularly attends national events, like Belgium's National Day celebrations, and represents her family during state visits. Both princesses are gaining valuable experience that will serve them well as monarchs. While their public duties are important, these young royals also face challenges unique to their countries. In Spain, Princess Leonor will one day navigate the complex political landscape and the ongoing debate around the monarchy's role in modern Spain. On the other hand, Princess Elizabeth will have to unite Belgium's diverse regions and linguistic communities. Her future role as queen will require her to bridge divides and ensure Belgium remains united. Thank you for watching this comparison of Princess Leonor and Princess Elizabeth. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Royal Hidden News for more updates on the world of royalty.